How's it going everyone? Daxels here and today we are reacting to Jeff Kaplan, the secret behind Overwatch competitive matchmaking. This was a suggested video, it's been in there for quite a while, I know there's a lot of suggested videos that has been in there for quite a while because there's like 50 plus more reactions to do. I'm sorry guys, I am trying to get through them as much as possible, it's just some of them are like 20 minutes long and it's, it's a lot harder to get through like 20 minute videos to render and stuff. It's all editing stuff but uh, I will be getting through them all don't worry and I will get to your video if your video is not there do not worry without further ado let's get into the video though. and away we go developer update hey everybody this is Jeff from the overwatch team I'm really excited to be here doing another one of these developer updates. We decided to look at what hot topics were out there and try to address a bunch of those. Um, I know you have a lot of questions about the matchmaking system. Just wanted to give you guys, you know, as much information as possible so you know how all this stuff works. Um, something that I, I hear a lot from people is competitive play is completely unbalanced. But um, <laughs> the reason why uh, you get matched, you know, against the best rogue gamer eSport enemy team and you feel like your teammates they're all playing the game with no hands is because all of us <laughs> on the overwatch team at and at blizzard we feed on your negative experience so wow. we want you to feel really frustrated and angry um basically i want you guys buying loot boxes in the store when your <laughs> skill rating goes down we want this to be a thing where after that humiliating competitive games you go to a store oh man maybe i'll be lucky enough to get a cool player icon um so we've announced <laughs> tracer is a gay character um been following the discussion we know it's a very heated debate of, of people wanting, you know, more and more and more. And <laughs> we want to really create this uh, feel and excitement for you guys of, wow, who knows what character will be gay the next time I log in. For example, we have a lot of feelings between Reaper and Torbjorn. So we all know that they are attracted to each other, but does Torbjorn um, have the hardware to please Reaper? <laughs> I apologize for not giving all the details right now, but we're going to have um, a lot of explanations coming very soon. But for now, enjoy this rich gate love cosmetic reward simulation that we've been developing. And we want to wish you and your dumb family a very um, warm and gay holiday season. And thank you for everything you guys have done for us. We appreciate it. Okay, Jeff. That's funny. That's funny. They should release that as the official videos. They, they, that's good. I like that. Okay, everyone, that is the end of the video. If you enjoyed that video, make sure you check out the original. I'll leave a link in the description down below so you can go check it out for yourselves. If you enjoyed this video, though, leave a like, comment what you'd like me to react to next, subscribe if you're new or you just haven't yet. I will see you in the next video. Laters! Oh,